How to Create an Outbound Zip Trunk To create an outbound trunk, navigate to the Trunks section and select the Voice Out option. Click on Add New and a window with the required outbound trunk settings will be opened. Enter a memorable name for the SIP trunk. This friendly name will be used as the main identifier for the trunk. Set the maximum number of simultaneous calls for the trunk in the Capacity Limit field. Define the maximum permitted fund expenditure in U.S. dollars per trunk per rolling 24-hour period before traffic is blocked in case of a system abuse. By default, a loud IP address is set to 0.0.0.0 forward slash zero value, meaning that traffic is allowed from any IP address. Please provide your system's IP address from which calls are sent to DIDWW. Our system will automatically reject the service if the call is not initiated from the provided IP address. If you are using a third party's DIDs as the caller ID, then you may set CLI rules. These rules are available to manage conditions when the caller ID does not match a phone number included in the allowed CLI list. The three possible CLI rule options are to reject the call, to replace the original CLI with a selected default CLI, or to send the original CLI. If you would like to use only specific DID numbers that you have purchased on the DIDWW platform for CLI purposes, then you can select those numbers in the CLI Settings section. These allowed caller IDs may be selected from the available DID numbers acquired from DIDWW, and a filter is provided to enable users to list specific DIDs. By default, all DID numbers in the customer's account may be used as caller IDs on outbound trunks. When you have completed the configuration of this SIP trunk, click Submit to save and activate the settings. Once the outbound SIP trunk has been created, the SIP credentials for that trunk may be viewed by selecting the Credentials option for that trunk. The password may be regenerated by clicking on the Refresh button. The Share button allows the user to send these SIP credentials to a system administrator for configuration of the outbound trunk. To view or change the configuration of the outbound trunk, select the Edit option in the drop-down menu under the Actions heading. In addition, the trunk status may be switched to be either Operational, Green, or Disabled. For more information, please start a live chat directly from the top menu on your user panel, or please take a look at the knowledge base on our website.